That's a good question, Faisal. Faisal here have a question as long as the Muslims is answering about obviously they, they are covered to answer. Faisal here is asking a question, how Jesus become God? Is God? He was born, become part of his creation. Okay. Uh, you see, I'm going to use the logic you are using. Is that fair, people? Can we use the logic Muslim use? We should use it always, because obviously this is the only convincing logic. So, according to your knowledge, or according to your logic, if we can call it logic, that Jesus, he cannot be God because he's part of his creation. That's wonderful. Allah have hands. Who is the one who created the hands of Allah? Can you tell me? Allah have hands. Allah have a shin. Allah have eyes. Even the Jews, they made fun of this Allah, who his hands can do nothing. Chapter 5, verse number 64. Is the hand of Allah is part of his creation or created by somebody else? Are you there, Faisal? Do you like to call me? No, I'm answering you from your religion, because if I answer it from my own, you will not accept anyway. But anyway, you give up, right? Because you have no answer. For me, it doesn't make any difference. Why? Because Jesus says before Abraham, I am. So his existence have nothing to do with his birth. So he was exist before the creation, as you claim, of the flesh. Before Abraham, I am, Jesus said. How Jesus can be exist before Abraham, before his birth? Simply, for his existence have nothing to do with his birth as a human. He exists before Abraham. And Jesus here answering your question. And then if we go to the Quran, we will find the same that Jesus is exist before everybody. How? The Quran confirmed that Jesus is the Word of God. And is the Word of God created? If we search right now in Islamic website, all Islamic books, you will find that Muslims believe that the Word of God is not created. Well, that is Jesus. So are you against your Quran now? This is your city Quran saying the following that Jesus and the Muslim they add their own fiction translation to the words, which is not there, trying to fix it. Horribly written, exposing the 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 the, the, silliness, the silliness of Muhammad. So this verse is supposed to speaking against the Trinity, right? Okay. All people of the book commit no excuse in your religion, nor says that of Allah, aught but the truth. Christ Jesus, son of Mary, was between two brackets, is not in the Quran. A messenger of Allah. Okay, we will go with this. He is what? Messenger of Allah. Then his word. Okay, let me ask you. Was the word exist before the messenger or after the messenger? Does any Muslim can answer? Was the word of Allah exist before Jesus or after Jesus? Now here, Faisal, he will decide to retreat and he will not answer. Listen carefully. Was the word of Allah, which is Jesus, exist before Jesus as a flesh or after? Who was exist first? Who is a Muhammad and can help us? Look what Faisal he said. He said, this is stupid. 
Thank you, Faisal. Faisal, he agree that Quran is a stupid. He admit because how we say that Jesus is created as a Muslims, and then we find that Jesus is the Word of God. So how the Word of God can be created? So the point of existence of Jesus was when he was in heaven, not when he was in earth. He is the Word of God. And this is exactly what the book of John, chapter 1, verse 1 says. But Faisal agree that the Quran is a stupid book. For Jesus was exist before he was created as a human being, according to your stupid Quran. It's in the front of you. And not only that, what about Jesus being the Spirit of God? Is Jesus a Spirit proceeding from Him? This is your stupid Quran. So what the Spirit of Jesus created? If the Spirit of Jesus is created, that means Allah is created too, because this is the Spirit of God. According to your Quran, Jesus has the Spirit of God. It's in the front of you. And now Faisal, he will go mute. All what he will say, he will say, this is stupid. He will not dare to answer. So our Bible get you busted, your Quran get you busted. Should I borrow somebody else? Should I go to the Hindus? And not only that, by the way, the Muslim they claim that there are people who believe in the oneness of God, right? But if you ask Muslims, is the Quran created? If yes, I'll tell us, please, is the Quran created? Muhammad in the chat, tell us, please. Is the Quran created? They will say no. Okay, so now we have Allah is not created. We have the Quran is not created. So the Quran is coming from where? Madness. If the Quran is not created, if the word of Allah is not created by Allah, so it's coming from where? So now we have two divine and created. What is the oneness of God? <clears throat> hmm? If I go right now and search in Prophet Google, peace be upon him. I will search for the following. Was the Quran created? The answer will be very astonishing. The Quran is the word of Allah. Maybe he exalted, not created. So, if Jesus is the word of Allah, he is not created too. And then how we can say it's the word of Allah if it's not created by Allah? How this word belong to him if it's not made by him? Do you see how stupid this religion is? So now we have two any created individuals. And not to forget that Muhammad, he claimed that the Quran will come in the judgment day as a man. A man who looked like a ghost. Dead ghost. This is how silly this cult is. And the funny, the same verse here, saying don't say Trinity, but here Muhammad is coming with different Trinity. 
saying that you can be three and one in the same time. Be carefully. Jesus is the messenger as a man. Jesus is the word, yet he's a man. Jesus is the spirit of God, yet he is a man. Three and one in the same time. Do you see it? So the same stupid verse saying, say it no trinity is the same verse proving different form of trinity. Any Abdul? Anyone? G Mu, you can contact me only if you are a Muslim. If you are not, you chat here, like the rest. Do we have any Abdul have anything to say? Anyway, uh, you know, guys, I'm thankful that Allah, he gave me the blessing that when I sit on the grass, I make it a green. And this is why now many countries around the world, they are trying to have contract with me. All what I need to do all day long, I fly from place to place, sit in the ground and make it a green. Actually, there's an island called the Green Land. It is called this way because I sat there. Since I drank from the fountain of life. I will tell you a different story, which is not really nice, maybe. Once I met a woman, she is so beautiful. I decide to shake her hand. I shake her hand, she turned green. Hello? Why people are calling me? If you're not a Muslim, you don't call me. If you're not a Muslim, you don't call me. Let me see. Is this guy is a Muslim? If he's not, he will be blocked immediately. So anyway, I'm telling you this is a true story. That this woman, you know, I shake hand with her, she became a green brother. Because anything I touch become a green. Okay. Hello? This is the same. Yes, my friend, you are live on air. Oh, thanks very anyway, much for having me. Story. Can you mute your tone, please? All right. So, is what do you okay want to now? say? What do you, yeah, it's okay. What do you want to say to us? Go ahead. You are a Muslim? Yes, I am, actually. All right. What do you like to say to us? You are welcome. Um, yeah, I have a question about Jesus, man. You have what? I have a question about Jesus. All right, go ahead. Um, yeah, there is this um, this chapter in Matthew. Yeah. Um, the sixth chapter or the seventh chapter. Eh? Hello. Yeah, I hear you. Go ahead. Yeah, yeah. In this chapter, if I'm not mistaken, it clearly indicates that Jesus is an obedient mortal. What? What? And God is the master. Jesus is an. It's just a. It's just an obedient servant. Okay. He's an obedient servant. Oh, okay. Yeah, and God is the master, uh -huh. and Lord as well. All right. So what? Uh, yeah. what where, is, where, where, where it says that Jesus is just a servant and he is not a master? Matthew says. Yeah, in Matthew um, chapter six and seven. Yeah, because I'm no, having my six, Quran. Okay, we're, and... we're in chapter six. It says that because obviously you are reading an article, right? You must have read an article. No, no, yeah. Matthew. But I'm having my uh, my Quran with me, and um, yeah, they indicated that in Matthew, yeah, verses six in and Quran, seven. 
in the Quran it says in Matthew the Quran says that yeah look the Quran that I'm having okay yeah. so okay. it points out that in but the there's Bible nowhere in the Quran it, the name of Matthew is mentioned what is that no you don't understand what I'm trying to say so you said to me the Quran you have a Quran and the Quran says yeah the following right but the Quran never mentioned the name of Matthew no, I mean in the Bible there is the book of Matthew. Okay, okay the, but the, so you, are saying the you, you, are, you are saying you saw that in the Quran you have. Yeah, yeah, uh, because I'm having my own um, Quran, and in yeah, this Quran, uh, so they how, are you, try, how uh, you have your Quran, and your Quran mentioned yeah. Matthew. The Quran never mentioned Matthew. Can you tell me which verse in the Quran mentioned Matthew? No, um, bro, this is like um, a commentary in the Quran that I'm telling you. Okay. Oh, the Quran so it's not commentary in the Quran. Oh, okay, that's amazing. So the, the Quran commentary in Matthew 6, it says that? Yeah. Oh, so okay. I'm trying and where, to... And where it says from... that? Okay, where it says that in Matthew 6? It says Jesus is not God, yeah. he's just a servant. I think it's um it's about these um, verses in the Bible or in, in Matthew where the devil is trying to tempt um jesus you remember this okay but that but that it says but the satan he said to him if you are son of god throw yourself and then your father will send the angels to save you it, it says there he is son of god yeah but how can um the devil tell that to the, the god devil, the devil is talking he said did not do what the devil he want but the devil he, he, he speak to your god too the devil he said yeah, to but him, if I the devil, the devil yeah, but, in your religion, this, did he disobey yeah. even Allah? What? Did the devil disobey Allah? In Islam? Yeah. Uh, in, is that a question? In Islam, you're trying to say that the devil disobeyed Allah. Yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, that so is, that here, is, that is here so. Jesus, here, here Jesus, Shaitan is talking to him. He's trying to find out who is this person. Is he really a son of God? And he is trying if he because if he do what Satan he want, then this this person is a human like everybody. If he could not make him, then he cannot be a human like everybody. So, uh, according to your religion, is Jesus a sinner? According to my religion, as far as I remember, no. Okay. No. So, so Satan no. he failed. Okay. No. No. I will go with you. You just said something very important. I, re I respect your honesty. According to your religion. No, according to my understanding, I mean, no I might be wrong. Okay. Yeah. No, my friend, no problem. No problem. So, no, it's, uh, it's, it is actually true. According to the Quran, Jesus is holy. Chapter 19, verse number 19. But we need to ask ourselves now a question why Jesus is holy and Muhammad is not? Yeah, because Jesus is holy, because uh, Jesus, unlike Muhammad, Jesus is not having a biological father, okay? okay. So, so, so the reason, yeah. okay, I will go with you. This is very nice to say, actually, very smart. Jesus is holy because he don't have a father like us. But Adam don't have a yes. father too. Yeah, but Adam, on the other hand, uh, is also not having a mother. So it's still it's there's what? a difference between Adam. Adam is not having a biological mother. Jesus, we see, he used to have a biological mother who was okay. Mary. Okay. So Jesus, he have, he have a mother. Adam, he don't have father, no father. neither he have mother. It shouldn't Adam be more holy then? Because he didn't have a father, neither a mother. Shouldn't, yeah, this question, yeah, I think it's a smart question, but again, um uh, I, I look i'm not well vast okay so uh okay, no i problem. think I will go adam, you take adam it easy, easy. Matthew, holy Matthew. Man. okay when we say yeah, maybe adam when, when we holy say man. a person is holy what does holy mean we say a person is holy hmm. what holy a holy I, I, yeah i think holy means like somebody who is completely righteous um truthful and yeah is comf it's like almost perfect, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, Not almost because, uh, because don't you call Allah perfect. holy? Is Allah holy according to you? No, Allah is the holiest of holies. There's the no holiest holiest of holies. There's no holiest, there's no holy either. You are holy or not. 
is nothing holiest and holy because if I am holiest than you, and that means you are not holy. No, no, no. That means I am holy. Uh, that friend, friend. If you are holy, let us use, let us use language. Holy. Let us use language. If I say you are cleaner than I, that means I'm not clean. I have dirt. Correct. No. Uh, yeah, what, no? This is not my. This is my this is not my understanding. My understanding is if you are clean and I am clean. So now we have to check this out. Who is cleaner? You, uh, there can be a small dead or yeah. an unfinished. How um, you can be cleaner um, if you are holy? Holy is the top. To call a person holy, he must be the top clean. There's nothing because if he if you, you have one you touch, remember, what, what, my friend, the did you remember he, that he really clean, says, clean is Allah about says sin. that he is clean, the best of friend, clean. Hold on, hold on. The word clean here yeah, is, about, is, is about cases. sin, correct? But, the word clean, we are using the word sin. Is it sin what will make us unholy? Correct? Sin. What? Sin. Sin, sin. Yeah. Okay. So, did Jesus commit any sin? Yeah, this stuff is a different question. You no, said holy, you, but did I... Did Jesus commit any sin? As far as I know, um, maybe only one sin, yeah. Which which one? So why the Quran call him holy? Yeah, because yeah, because Jesus was asked if uh, he was the king of the Jews, but he did not uh, answer this. He decided to. No, he answered. Um, no, he answered. He said, "You no, said that." He, he agreed with them. He said, "You yeah. said so." He said, "What well, you are asking yeah, about?" Some... No, my ask. friend, my friend, no, don't, don't don't make things up. He asked him, "Are you the king of the Jews?" He said, "You said so." So he agree. You you just you just call okay. me king. You said so. No, but are you, the question are you the is, king? are you? My friend, yeah, this is the you. Question don't, is, don't fabricate things. Secondly, don't we have the Quran saying that Jesus is holy already? Yes. Okay. And this is Quran being given to Muhammad 600 years after Muhammad? Yes. Okay. So 600 years pass and Jesus is holy. Yeah, you know, like I said, uh, okay. my understanding now, is that now, Jesus Muhammad, can be holy. Muhammad, in the time of Jesus, was he holy? Muhammad in the time of Jesus. No, in the time of Muhammad, sorry. I mean, when we were Muhammad, the person, was he holy? Yeah. He was? Yeah, Muhammad is, was a righteous man. Um, he, no, he I'm asking, is, is he best... holy? Did he commit sin? No, 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 he was not holy. Okay, I want you to read for me. I don't know if your screen yes. is open. I hope your screen is open. I will put for you the verses from the Quran. What do you mean, my screen? Yeah, but just be sure that to mute the YouTube so we don't have double sound. Okay. This is your Quran in chapter 48, verse number two, saying that Allah is saying, May Allah forgive your sin. Speaking to Muhammad. Mm. So now you confirm, and everybody heard you, that Jesus is holy. 600 years after Jesus, still Jesus is holy. Wonderful. Muhammad, in his time, he is a sinner. And the Quran confirmed that. Yeah, uh, I can recall that uh, that is true. So, okay. but, um, so how Jesus, still the best okay, how role Jesus is a was. human being like us, and he is holy. Yeah. And how Muhammad is the most righteous person? You just saw, named him that, right? The I most told you righteous already, person, uh, but he's a sinner. Jesus is not a human being like me and you. He uh -huh. is simply not with a biological father. Okay? okay. So me and you, we are having both biological parents. Okay. okay so now and Jesus. Can... Okay. So you are saying that Jesus' nature is above sin. It's above sin. Yeah. He... <sighs> I look, I'm not so about. Yeah, okay, maybe yes. I, okay. Yeah, I, yeah. So Jesus' nature, people, is above sin. Muhammad's nature is the nature of a human being, is a sinner. So who's God? Yeah, that. So what is God then? God is the one whose what? nature is above sin. God is the one whose nature mm -hmm. is above sin. Yeah, but we um, look. Okay, we're talking about, like I told you in Matthew, uh, there is this, uh, there is uh, in, in friend, Matthew. There's exactly. nowhere in Matthew is saying what you are saying. That is not a true. No.
Jesus said, I okay. am being sent by my father. And then Jesus, he said, even he said to his disciples, I will wash your feet. But doesn't mean that he is uh, uh, like a servant, uh, a slave. You know, he is being humble. He says, if you don't do what I'm doing, you don't belong to me. And then Jesus is the one who said, I am from above. You are from below. And Jesus is the one who said, I am before, before Abraham, I am. So all of this is Jesus saying that before Abraham, I but am. That's, so, that's so, metaphorical. No, not metaphorically. They ask him about his age. He said, how, how Abraham, he saw your day. Abraham, he saw your day. He said, truly, truly, I say to you, before Abraham, I am. He said, how you, how you are before Abraham and you are not even 50 years old. So this is not metaphorically. It's not up to you. The whole yeah, Bible speaks about the whole Bible speak about Jesus' his existence. Have nothing to do with his birth. Everything was yeah, created you know, by him and for him. By him created. So here yeah, now, bro, now uh, me and you, we, we came to an agreement that Jesus' nature is above sin. Muhammad's nature is yes. sinner nature. Yeah, it's okay. sinful. Yeah. Let us stop here. Is Allah nature is above sin or he is a sinner too? You know, first of all, um, we don't know what is Allah's nature, okay, uh, or God's nature, because like we only know about um, as far as as far as we are talking, we only know about Jesus and Muhammad. Jesus is having a mother, but not a father. So therefore, we have some clue about Jesus' no nature. No problem. I'm but asking you now. Let us yeah, focus for, focus on the topic, please. When I say the nature, I'm not talking about his skin, you know, his hands, how they look like. No, I'm talking about the nature of sin. Jesus is. Is, you are the one who said to me, Jesus' nature is above sin. Wonderful. Is Allah nature above sin? Yeah, yeah. I would like to. I would like to agree that Allah's nature is above sin. But okay. I, again, I so, don't know what okay. is, is it, Allah's nature is it, like. Is it, yeah. is it okay? If I go to you now and I tell you, go and flirt with the wife of your son, is that a good thing to do? My son, I don't have son. I don't have no, any I'm saying, son. Let us say you have a son and he's married. You have a wife. Huh? And then I say to you, go and flirt with her. Go. Go to her house. Tell her that you want her in bed. No, is that, I will... is, that, is that evil from, from Satan or this is from Allah? You know, if Allah orders me to do that, then I suppose Allah is having a good reason why I should do that. Because um, so Allah a, is creating good, me. There is, there, is huh? there is a good sin in Islam? There is a good sin in Islam? Yeah, there is a good sin. For example, oh. you can so, lie. So you are saying to life. me now, if Allah told you to flirt with your own son wife, Allah, he have mm -hmm. a good reason for that. What is the good reason? Tell yeah. Yeah, first of all, Allah never told me that, so I can oh, only did. draw oh, examples. Did. Chapter huh? 33, verse number 37. He told Muhammad, Chapter? He told Muhammad, Chapter 33, verse number 37. Allah, he okay, told let me Muhammad, open my Quran again. that this woman is yours. So have fun. No, you said chapter what? 33, verse number 37. 33, 33 37. 33, 37. Please give me some, some moment, please. 33, 37. Uh, no, he is not. He did not call me before. Did you call me before ever? My friend, did you call me yeah. ever before? Yes, I used to I, I used to call you like um yeah before, yeah. And they are saying, did you call Hello? before and you left Islam? Did I call before? I was um I was uh, strongly doubtful, but I this still did not make up my mind. I'm still looking for more um oh, okay. yeah. Yeah, I call you. You remember that, yeah? No, I don't know. And I, I was trying I to receive calls from everybody. I don't know. Anyway. Okay. You said 
my friend, you can look in the screen. There's no need for all this stuff oh. to look for forever. Look, look in the screen. I we can't have it really there. Find it. Okay, okay. Let me open it. Okay, right. I can see it. Um, and remember when you said to him, Zay, when you said to him, hmm. um, Zayed bin Harita, the freed slave of the Prophet, on whom Allah has bestowed grace by guiding him to Islam. And you want Muhammad to have done favor by promoting him. Keep your wife to yourself and fear Allah. That you, yeah, keep your wife and fear Allah. Yeah, that's, oh, so, yeah, so, you so say, Allah saying to Muhammad, why, why you are training the man? Keep your wife. When I told you, we should take it, take her. Why? So it says what can, keep your what wife kind of and God, fear Allah. Why, why God want to encourage relationship between? A married woman and a married man. And the married woman is married to the son. Is that ethical in Islam? Yeah, but this privilege is um, is unique to Muhammad only. So this you know? is a privilege. Like, to, um, to, uh, so it's a privilege to be uh, to be filthy. No, not necessarily. I think like we are. What, what do you mean, not necessarily? So now, if you go to your son. And you flirt with the wife, and Allah told you this is a privilege to you. That will make you a good person. Like I said, uh, uh, um, Allah is having reason for whatever commandment that He. And what is the reason, Muhammad? Command. You have already many wives. What is the reason? Already you have many wives. Is he single? Is Muhammad? He, he, he cannot find a wife, and the women she is married already. No, not the women Muhammad she is can married have already. Any wife. Listen, listen. Muhammad here, he broke the commands of God. When God, he gave Moses, he gave him command. And the command says, don't wish what is not yours. Don't look at the women is not yours. Don't take the money. Don't steal the money is not yours. So Muhammad is breaking the command of God. And his God cannot be the God of Moses. Okay, but, um, but you did hide in yourself what Allah has already made known to you that He will give her to you, my, that which Allah will make manifest you, the fear the people. So, here, uh, what I can see so far is that uh, Muhammad is given this privilege, you know, that. Um, well, hold on. That how, he you can... call, how you call fornication a privilege? Like fornication, a privilege. Yeah. What do you mean fornication? Like the, uh, Muhammad well, this is, is fornication. This, this is a married like... woman. Any relationship with married women is a fornication. No, but remember, this this lady was uh, divorced also before Muhammad can get. What before? The, the woman is married. The woman is married. Why does God is encouraging relationship with married women? And what kind of a prophet he go to the house of his own son when the husband is not there and he flirt with the women? Didn't his God say to him the opposite? She says, shame on you. As an example, no, have, right. as an example, we have a story in the Old Testament where a prophet of God, he commit, committed sin by taking the wife of somebody else. He did not sleep with her until the husband died, but he sent him to war to die, evil. God condemned his action. Here, the God of Islam is a blessing him. He's saying to him, why? Why are you are hiding what Allah told you? He's encouraging him to have relationship with married women. And you said to me, this is a privilege. Yeah, um, I think this privilege is reserved only to Muhammad. That's why you will not see anybody doing this okay. again. Although so we are from you now bound that to... Muhammad, you have a privilege to be perverted. To be what? Perverted. No, I will not say perverted because you can see. Uh, so if I go to your house, if I go to your house, and I see your wife, and your wife she is beautiful, I would my respect to your wife. I'm not make, making fun of you. And I see your wife, and I want to sleep with her. That does not make me a bad person for you. That make me I'm a person of a privilege. You know. Uh, let me give you an example. No, you know, uh, you I just give you one. I just give you one. 
I go to your yeah. I go to your house when you are not there. Now I say to the, your wife, "You are beautiful. I like you." And we go to bed. Yes. Your answer is, "This is good." You said I, you flirt with my wife and then you go to bed with my wife. No, but that's not what happened here. Um, no, this is what happened Muhammad, here. He flirted with her because he want to have her. And now Allah is telling yeah, him, why you are hiding what Allah he told you? What he told him, you will take this woman, take her. So now he went to the house of the man. So he, so the yeah. wife, she will tell him, listen, he did it on purpose. So that when the husband, and obviously they are in bed together already. The woman, when the husband, he, she came, he came. He was happy, excited. He told him, your father was here and he flirted with me. A person who have honor, you will go to fight the father. Yeah, what shame, shame on you. You are a scumbag. You are filthy. How you do that to me? Instead, remember, Muhammad, Muhammad, he cannot he's play games with him. He will kill him. So he went there. He said to he him, said, you know, my wife, my wife, she I is will, not I... uh, good to me. I want to divorce her. But he never mentioned divorce before. And uh, the wife, she yeah. told him that your father was here and he was uh, flirting with me. Right. So I thought like what happened here was like Muhammad complimented this woman that uh, she is beautiful, how, that she how, is okay. How, he complimented, how, how this is complimented? You know, he flirted with her. If I say okay, to you, can, if you, I can, say, you, if I say you to your wife, if I say to a man, if your neighbor, if, you, if your friend come to your house and he say to your wife, my heart fell into you, that is a compliment? Yeah, that can be a compliment here yeah, too. Oh, that is a compliment. No, the guy uh -huh. is flirting with your wife. She's married. What kind of a friend? He comes to your house, flirting with your wife. If 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 you are married and a woman, um, an unknown woman said that, oh, my brother, you are very handsome. You are okay. You know, that does not he necessarily not say, mean... He did not say you are beautiful. Yeah. Secondly, secondly, why he is looking... He, he saw her already many times before. What beautiful. The, the story says that when he came to her house, Allah, he sent wind and he lifted the curtain and she was almost wearing nothing. And she was a beautiful white soul. So Muhammad, he said, Subhanallah, mu'allif al Please be to Allah, the one who made my heart flip for you. So not only is a flirting, he's telling her, his intention, he want her. How this is a privilege for a man. He is already married. He have tons of wives and she is already married too. Yeah, uh, I agree that uh, Muhammad uh, used to see this woman before, but it's the first time that Muhammad is seeing this woman in this particular state. And oh, this is the first time he this... saw her naked. So the first time he saw her naked, he decided to jump on her. Yeah, but remember, Muhammad is also a man. He's a sinner also. Like, uh -huh. uh, naturally... Okay, so is it a yeah. sin? Okay, you just said Muhammad is a man. He's a sinner also. So is it a sin to do yes. what he did or it was a good thing? No, Sina here, sorry, uh, what I want to say is that Muhammad can be tempted, you know, like anybody, you know. No problem, so, uh, no problem. I, okay, yeah. Muhammad can be tempted like everybody. I can be tempted yes. too, but I'm not going to go to the house of my friend and flirt with his wife. Isn't it us? Isn't it supposedly a prophet of God is the first one to control himself? Yeah, but um, this... This does not always happen, you know. The prophets sometimes not you can always see happen. It's always the... always happen with Muhammad. And look here, what kind of God he is encouraging the man who is tempted. You just you are the one who used the word tempted. He is encouraged the man who is tempted to do what he's tempted to do. He's encouraging him. Shouldn't he say to him, Good, thank you for saying to the man, keep your wife? He should say the opposite. He said, Don't okay, that's wonderful. You say to the man, keep your wife. That's a very good of you. Repent. Don't think about the no, wife I anymore. Think, she is his wife. I think, I think Allah is not encouraging Muhammad here. He is simply he is supporting. encouraging. He is saying to him, why you hide what Allah revealed to you? What Allah revealed to him? That this woman, she is yours. Are you afraid of from people what they will say? So he knew that people will say bad things about him because this is wrong. Allah manifests to him. What kind of God he manifests to him about a married woman? At least let her get divorced yet first. And what kind of a God he sent wind to open the curtain so the prophet can see her naked? And then what kind of God yeah. he said to the man, why you said to him, divorce your wife, don't divorce your wife? 
when you should have her. Okay, so uh, I really don't don't have any more clue how to get around this. I only think like uh, Muhammad was tempted because he's simply a human like any one of us, and he's a special man. He this You call me, remember? Only you him. call me. You call me to talk how Jesus is God, and you agreed that the nature of Jesus is above above sin. So yes. Jesus, Jesus will not, will not be tempted by a naked woman. Correct. Are we comparing Jesus and Muhammad now? I'm not trying to compare these two. Uh, I'm, not I already, to compare. Uh, I'm not asking you to compare. I want an answer. Jesus cannot be tempted by naked women, according to your understanding, because he is above yes. the nature. Okay. So, guys, yes. Jesus yes, cannot be tempted by any women. But let me ask you then, isn't it Jesus a man like everybody? No. No. He's God. Then. Yeah. He's God. He's not. No. I can't say he's God like uh, well, this moment. Any man, any any man exists so, in this earth. Hold on. Any man exists in this earth, including me and you, can be tempted. If you say no, you are lying. Yes, I, okay. I already. So we agree that, that all men, we agree that today. all men in this earth, all men, no exception, can be tempted and they, are, and they got tempted. But Jesus, yes. nobody can tempt Jesus. Nobody. Satan, he tried. He failed. So, what make Jesus above is holiness. And what make him above, that he is from above, not from below. And Muhammad is just a bad person, hijacking the business of a prophethood. He is no prophet. He is making Quran just to serve as a private part. Yeah, I call to uh, understand very well what Matthew is saying, Matthew 10, Matthew 14, for example. Okay, Matthew 14, you know, yeah, thou shalt worship the Lord, thy God, and him only shall you serve. So, you you are very, you are well versed, okay? Um, what? what is, I, yeah, my understanding is that you are well versed, okay? Yeah, you are familiar with this, I have what I'm saying. That you are well versed, that you, really? you are familiar with the text. Right? I'm not, Hello? I don't understand. You are very. Somebody can tell me what he's saying. You are very I, what? No, I said you are well, well versed. You are well versed. You read extensively. Well versed. Well versed. Okay. Ah, okay. Well versed. Okay. Yeah. Okay. 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 And? Yes. So, uh, Matthew four ten is saying that you shall worship the Lord thy God, and Him only shall you serve. So I don't get the context. I only see this um, verse. Okay. So. Who is speaking here in your country? Is it Jesus who is speaking here, or is Yahweh who is speaking? Jesus is speak. Jesus is speak to to Satan. So Jesus is telling Satan that you should worship your Lord. No, he is quoting for God. him. He's quoting for him what the command of God is that the only one you worship is God. So here, the Satan is asking, well, you know what? I will give you this, I will give you that, I promise you this. And then Jesus answering him, refuting him, that the true righteous person is the one who only do such a thing only to God, no one else. So you are no one. I am the one who people will bow down for him. And then the devil, he continue speaking and saying, well, you know what, if you throw yourself from the top of the mountain, well, the angels will, you know, come and don't worry about you about, about what will happen and then jesus said to him it says don't uh, don't like try your lord you're trying me trying me i am your lord you are trying me so jesus here is confirming in every statement that he is the lord god and you cannot tempt god and that's why jesus in verse number seven said said to him it's written again thou shall not tempt the lord the god so Satan is trying to tempt Jesus, and Jesus is saying to him, it's written that you should okay. not try. Don't even try. It doesn't work with me. And you agreed that Satan, he could not do anything. Satan, he tried. When, when the translation in the Bible says he tempt, it's, it's an act. It's an act of temptation, but it failed. Jesus wasn't not that tempted. So I can try to tempt you, 
I can say to you, if you believe in me, I will give you women. And then you say to me, you know, like what Allah do. Allah, he promised us women with bigger breasts. He's trying to tempt me and you and everybody. For me, I'm not tempted by this. I laugh at it. Okay, I so I, 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 I get what you are. So it is um, this uh, Matthew uh, 4.10 is a situation between Jesus and the devil only. So I, I was thinking, okay, this is like a general statement to uh, everybody. Okay. Yeah. My friend, my friend. When you, when you read, yeah, yeah. when you read, yeah, it's read difficult. Whole, it's difficult. So no, I, it's not yeah. difficult. No, uh, it's not difficult. Not difficult. When you read, read the story from yeah. the beginning, so you will not misunderstood. Maybe you are just reading no, the quotation. My Quran here is in my Quran here. No Quran this is, Matthew, there's no uh, Quran. First of all, there's no Quran mentioning Matthew. That is a stupid author adding things there. Secondly, uh, 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 the Quran you have, even the Muslims who they are writing the Quran for, you can't understand. How they can understand our Bible? I mean, they can't even understand, explain their own book. And now suddenly they became experts. So I think book. you don't understand what I'm trying to get at. What I'm I trying understand. To say is that you, are I'm a book, you are in a book, you call it Quran. But the truth is, this is not Quran. Yes. Because nowhere in the Quran it's mentioned the book of Matthew. No, this is only a quotation from the Bible. Exactly. So this is an idiot. The... This yeah. is an idiot. He is putting things there that have nothing to do with the Quran. As an example, you said to me, you saw that in the Quran. What chapter, what verse? No, that's why I repeatedly said this is a quotation from My friend, the I'm asking you, from whoever. The quotation, the quotation yeah. you found it in which verse in the Quran, according to the book you have? No, this is just these uh, pages before you start having the first uh, surah or the first ayah in the Quran. It's okay, just, what, uh, what, it's what just, surah? What yeah. surah is the one he is trying to insert those things in? No, 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 he's not definitely doing that. He's not so why is quoting those he, things? What, what is the purpose of quoting them? Okay, I tell you, uh, it, it says here, Jesus and Muhammad, peace be upon them, in the Bible and the Quran, biblical evidence of Jesus being a servant of God and having no say in divinity. Okay, so, um, no, having no say, uh, this commentator is saying that Jesus is having no say in the divinity. Okay, and also there is, but Jesus is having no say in divinity. No say, you know no like, say. No say. S H A R E. Like my accent is very bad. I maybe that's why you are understanding. Like so, he is saying is that Jesus and, is not divine, right? Yeah, Jesus is not related to any divinity. It's not divine. Yes, yeah, simply. No, but, but, but okay. But this idiot, he just got himself busted. Why? Because he tried why? to teach you something. This idiot who wrote the book, an idiot, because he's trying to teach okay. you something. And you are the one who said to me that Jesus is above the nature of all mankind. Can you repeat that, please? You say to uh, me the, that the nature of Jesus is above the nature of all mankind. He's not like anyone, correct? Yes, yes. That means divine, because the nature of mankind is the nature of mankind. And anything, so else, what is... anything else can be called holy, it must be divine. So the nature of mankind is a sinner. The nature of Jesus is not a sinner. The nature of the angels, are, the, the, the angels themselves, they can commit sin, even in our Bible. Angel himself, he commits sin. He was thrown out of, 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 of the mercy of God. In the New Quran, New Quran, angels are liars. And they commit sin. They accuse Adam to do mischief, man. And Allah yeah, but, told them, uh, if you are a truth, what can truth? Yes. Huh? Okay, just for a moment. In my lifetime, I'm already almost 26 years old. I have seen locations. I have seen characters that are repeatedly being referred to as holy man. Uh, holy places. I don't care, I don't care. So those, if, those, are, those are false statements, one, because no man is holy, only God is holy. That's why I'm having difficulty to try no, to catch up have difficulty. Because, Don't be fool yourself. Yeah, because somebody, I, somebody said to you, the holy priest, he's not holy. Or the holy pope, he's not holy. Yes. Or the holy Christian prince, he's not or the holy. holy. Or the holy uh, prophet, the holy he's imam. not holy. Listen, my friend, yes. there's no, there's no, there's no one is holy. We can use the word as a language. Uh, to show respect of uh, like their their decencies, but when it's come to holiness, there's only one holy that is God. And now Do we you are have talking any about. Statement and now we are talking okay, about so who commits sin, who commit not. So, a person never commits sin. Deserve to be called holy, or he never commits sin. But it's not only just about committing sin. Jesus is way above that. As an example. 
Now, when you when I say to you, who is God? What is the definition of God you have? What? What is the def definition of God you have? When I say to you, you are a Muslim, and you say to me, you believe in God. So what God? No, I said I believe in Allah. Yeah. I know, um, I know. you believe in Allah. Yeah. Allah is His name. So what is Allah? Yeah. Okay. What is Allah? You give me a definition of Allah. What is? Yeah, Allah is the creator of everything that we That's are seeing around. That's a because says. Allah, because Allah, He could describe Himself that He is the same as Baal, but He is better. He is the same as what? Baal. Baal. What is Baal? Baal. 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 The, is the creator one of the creators? Baal is one ah, of the yeah, one yeah. of the pagan gods. Baal was very famous, very popular in the Middle East, and even in Europe. And people worship him. So Allah, He says, He is better than Baal. He is the best of the creators. So by doing that, Allah He admit that Baal is a creator, but Allah is better. Yeah, uh, I think, you know, I, this is one of the statements that I disagree with, you know, um, because, no, uh, for example, disagree but, that this is Quran. Either you leave Islam no. or, or, or you know, are you playing games with me, my friend? Because you, you, you called before. Are you playing the same game? I'm asking you, does it say in front of you? What? What do you call upon Baal and forsake the best of the creators? Does it say the best of the creators? Yes. Okay. So Allah, he put his name next to the name of Baal saying he is better than Baal he is the best of the creators by saying I am I you know I am the best of the creator why you pray to Baal when I am the best of the creator which means that's mean Baal is a creator and Allah is a creator but Allah is claiming that he's better otherwise comparing yeah, you know. myself you know if I say I am the best of the student that's mean there's other students I'm not the only one do you agree? Yeah, I understand that. I understand okay. your point. So I Allah is the best point. of the creators, but there's no other creators or there's other creators? Based on this statement, there are multiple creators and Allah okay. is the best so of how, all of them. So yeah. how when I ask you who is Allah, you said to me he's the, the only creator? No, I, I I said Allah is the creator of everything around us, including how, ourselves. How you know? That's what no, I said. He didn't, he didn't, hold on. He said that I am the best of the creator, so the creator of Baal is where? Where is Baal? You know, I told you a um, moment ago that this is one of the verses that I disagree with. So you can say who, who I am. Or so not. Like, well, you don't agree with the Quran huh? now, so you have to leave Islam then. Either you agree with it or you don't agree. If you don't agree, this means you leave Islam. Um, yeah. Uh, you know, if I got enough evidence, I don't mind. I can leave Islam, but still, I think you, I have to. One evidence, take my time. one evidence is enough as one thousand evidence. Either Allah is the only Creator, or He is not. So is He, according to the Quran, the only Creator? If He is the only Creator, and then He says He is the best of the creators, that means Allah is lying. Because I yeah, but say, you remember also when the Quran was being compiled. There is still uh, many part of the Quran that was not uh, added or that was somehow. Then you, uh, should, then you should agree that the Quran cannot be from God because simply Allah, He said, Inna No, did you remember Quranu. this point? Because Hold I, on. No. I, 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 Allah, He said in the Quran, Inna alayna jam'uhu wa Quranahu. It is on us to collect it and to preserve it and to, to, you know, to keep it. So, did Allah collect the Quran, preserve it? According to you, no. According to Allah, according to Allah, He will preserve the Quran. According to you, He did not. The preservation of the Quran, as you said, I have trouble agreeing with that hundred percent. Yeah. Okay. Um, so, yeah. So, I, I, so Allah, I'm still in it. Okay. So Allah, He could not preserve the Quran, could not collect the Quran. And actually, the one who collect the Quran is Uthman ibn Affan, not Allah. This is again uh, 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 proving that Muhammad is a fraud. But now. As long as you are saying you don't agree with this verse, you don't agree with that verse, well, the one who made the verse is who? Um, the one who revealed the verse um, is Allah, I believe, still, uh, through the Archangel Gabriel. So how Allah, he makes but now, why you don't what? agree with Allah then? 
Allah is the one who revealed no, this No, human beings were involved. You already know better than me. Human beings were involved and the compilation and a uh, lot of stuff happened here. You know, oh. combination of stuff. What do you, you, know? mean? you and, mean? You mean you Muslims, you added those words to the Quran? Yeah, Muslims are also human beings. They can be, they can be flawed. They can make errors. They can be having selfish interests. Okay. Muslims, we are all human beings at the end of the day. You know, so mm -hmm. we are not above. Yeah, so I, I am one of I, I am one of the many Muslims so now, who think that. So now, that, wh yeah. whatever I show you, anything stupid in the Quran, you will say to me, this is the error of a human being. Whatever is, no, I will not do that. Yeah, I anything I show you, that. anything I show you now, you will say to me, well, I don't agree with it. This is obviously error of a human being. This is somebody added there. So what kind of, what, what you are calling me, my friend? Why you call no, yourself I a Muslim? Call you. Why you call yourself a Muslim if there's no book to, left to, to follow? How you follow the book, which you cannot trust? You are saying to me that those verses is added by, non, by, by Muslims. So how you follow this book if you don't trust the book? Yeah, I follow this book uh, simply because there are many other um, wisdom, yeah, uh, what? that is, touch is, my heart. Yeah, there are many, many wisdom uh, passages wisdom? that okay, give me, heart, give me an no? example. Give me an example of the wisdom. Yes, there's many wisdom. Give me the wisdom. Give me the best wisdom you have in the Quran. Yeah, come on, bro. Come on. Uh, there are many wisdoms in the give Quran. Me one. Example, give me the, the best one. Huh? Give me the best one. Yeah. Yeah, for, for example, the Quran says that um, um, if you if you will kill um, one man, it's like you kill the whole mankind. You remember this? So why the Quran says kill them wherever you find them? Yeah, but this is a war situation also. This oh, is a situation. situation. This is a situation. So a second ago, none killing is wisdom. A second after, killing is wisdom. We yeah, but talking, no killing. We were talking, my friend, hold on. First of all, the verses you are quoting for me, Muhammad was quoting the Torah. This is not Allah. No, no, no that, that, what I'm telling you, he was I, quoting I the Torah. The it is a says, even in there it says, for this reason it was prescribed for the children of Israel that whoever slay a soul, unless, you know, like for not justice reason, he is as the same as someone who is in slaughter of everybody. And this is in the Ten Commandment. Don't, don't kill. So Muhammad is quoting the Jews. This is not Islam. The verse after it, Muhammad, he says, kill everybody. Those who they are against Allah, wage war on Allah, not wage war by taking sword. Now, right now, the punishment for me for speaking against Muhammad is death. This is waging war in Islam. So, the punishment of those who wage war against Allah and his apostles and strive, make mischief in the land, is what? They will be murdered. But even there, in Ultra, yeah, says, clearly, they should, clearly, be, mur they should be murdered. Do you see it? It says they yeah, should be murdered. Or they should yeah, be but, crucified. Or we should cut their hands. Yeah, but, so how the one yeah, but, who kill a human being for, for no crime he commit, was I did not, Commit a crime. This is what the verse is saying. If I did not kill anyone, I should not be killed. If I did not kill specifically, I should not be killed. The verse after it says, the one who is against the prophet kill him and cut his hands and put him in the cross. But you can him. see verse 33 is saying that those who wage war against Allah and his apostles and strive yeah. to make mischief in the land. So this is specifically um, isolating this group of people who are waging war against Allah and so his apostles and also... So you agree? You support, yeah. you support killing me? No, no, I will not do that. I will no. not. I don't support me killing me. I will you. not kill... I am, I am I will, according, I will to, your kill verse, according to your verse now, I'm causing mischief in the land. No, you, no? you are not causing mischief man. I okay, think hold on, you are hold on. just to show you that you are a hypocrite person is in the Quran chapter 9 verse number 9 okay. speaking about oh. shut up talking about killing the Christians and the Jews just because you don't believe in Islam no this vast territory I can see that it says waking war don't tell me against the verse, Allah. In the, the verse in the front of you it says fight those who don't believe in Allah nor the last day it doesn't say I those who fight you it. it says fight I against those who believe in Allah, who, who fight against those who believe not in Allah. So number one reason what? 
They believe not in Allah. Number one reason, and number two reason, no other laws they. But third reason, they don't forbid what Muhammad forbid, which means they don't follow Islam. Number four reason, those who don't acknowledge the truth, the religion of truth, which means they refuse Islam. From the people of the book, and the, so all the crime they did, they refuse Islam, and now we have to kill them. So how you say to me, the Quran, the wisdom says, if you killed one man, as if he killed all mankind, and now you want to kill anyone just because you don't accept Muhammad to be a prophet. Yeah, yeah. but you can also see that there is this part that, verse that says that if you kill one man, you kill the whole mankind. How that so all now I... Muhammad, all what he did, he justified the killing now. That if you kill one man, if you read the verse, by the way, this is about killing a Muslim. If you kill a Muslim, as if he killed one kind, but if you kill all the Hindus, it's okay. If you kill all the Christians, it's okay. You want me to show you the interpretation for the verse? Yes, please. Okay, let us go and see the verse. If you kill a Muslim. And now, if this is what it says, what you will do? Are you going to leave Islam? Or say yes, please, just to, you know, playing games. Like I said, um, I think um, the, this religion is too old and too deep. Um, yeah, yeah, too deep. Yeah, me, yeah. I, can, I, can, I can tell yeah. how too deep it is, yeah. So guys, this religion is yeah. too deep. Okay, too deep, it says the sperm coming from the backbone. Hmm. And too deep, it says that no, the no, prophet, he can flirt with his, like... It's too deep, hold on. And too deep that the prophet, he can he have a privilege, he can flirt with the wife of his son. Very deep. Now read with me. Which, uh, which book of interpretation you like to read from? Which one is your I favorite? I think um, Ibn, Ibn Kathir. Uh, Ibn Kathir, let us go to Ibn or, Kathir. Okay, let us go to Ibn Kathir. Here we go. We want to make you happy. Ibn Kathir. Oh, this is Ibn Kathir. This no. Uh, Ibn Kasi, this is Al-Jalal, I think. Yeah, this is Ibn Kathir, now in front of us. The highest yeah. is whoever kill a soul without justification, such as in retaliation or for, or for a murder or oh. causing of mischief in the earth. Okay. As if he killed all mankind. And now we could go down. He continue more, he says. Meaning, if anyone killed, he's repeating the verse here, uh, let's see where the enter of man. Okay, uh, do you uh, also uh, know that? Uh, um, my friend, the hold, on. hold on, hold on. Okay, hold on. Read it. It's about killing Muslims. If you kill Muslims. You are, so you, can see you are murdering. If you kill non-Muslims, this is only for Muslims. Read carefully. Whoever kills a soul that Allah forbid killing is just like the king of all mankind. Said Ibn Jabir. Oh, they will see it. He said, he who allow himself to shed the blood of a Muslim is the like who allow shedding the blood of all people. He who forbid the shedding the blood of one Muslim is like the one who forbid the shedding of the blood of all people. So this verse here, Muhammad is using it to not to kill Muslims, but we can kill Christians. Yeah, it's like uh, whoever kills one soul that Allah has no, forbidden. One Muslim. It's for Muslims. You cannot kill. No, but Muslims. you can see it's one soul. No problem, but the soul of a Muslim believer, because Allah forbid you from killing a Muslim believer. So whoever kill a soul is forbidden by Allah to be killed. But there's other souls, it's not forbidden by Allah to be killed, like the Christians, the Jews, the Hindus, the atheists, etc. Um, yeah, it's, it's definitely too complicated, okay? It's definitely okay, too take care, take care. You are just playing games. Yeah, it's complicated, complicated. And let me block you, actually. I have no time for, for, for liars. It's complicated. Even this one is complicated. Even this one is complicated.
There is wisdom in the Quran. And what is the wisdom? The sperm coming from the backbone of the man, and the sperm coming from the ribs of the women. And if you go to your wife, son, you are the son of your uh, wife of your son, share it with her. This is wisdom. This is wisdom, brother. Only Allah can come with such a wisdom. Uh, this is uh, ultimate fart. He is using the name of uh, Faisal. Hey, Faisal, ultimate fart is using your name. He's texting me in, uh, in Skype. Welcome to Nigeria. <coughs> Why you are using somebody else's name, ultimate part? Ultimate part. Oh, this is not ultimate part. I was wrong then. Okay. Is that, is that Faisal? Uh, yes, I am. All right, I'm Mr. Faisal. How are you, my friend? I'm good. How are you? I thought somebody using your name. Okay. No, that's so actually me. Okay, so what do you want to say to us? You were in here for a while and you Yeah, just sure give have... me a sec. I can't hear your voice very clearly. Just trying to fix my speaker. All right. Fix it and we will be happy to hear you. Do you hear me now better? Uh, I can't hear you, but not that uh, loud, actually. I can barely hear you. Okay, hold on. Let me see. Let me call you back. Hold on. Give me a second. <laughs> Which is strange because uh, I think this is from your side because the, the previous... Uh, Order, he don't not complain about my voice. Uh, yeah, the voice is very high in my side. This is this is only in your side, my friend. So fix your uh, fix your uh, speaker. I will give you a minute or two to fix it. Give me just text me. Tell me that I am ready. Fix your speaker, and I will call you. Well, I thought somebody is using his name. Call you now. Okay. Uh, hello. All right, Faisal, you hear me, my friend? Yes, I can hear you now. All right, what do you like to say to us, Faisal? Thank you for calling um, first. I appreciate, I, I appreciate that you're, I you're, also you're, appreciate you're being you, brother. brave. Yes, it's not actually being brave. I'm just saying what I feel is right. Okay. And what is actually more logical and makes more sense. All right. Uh, may, may I ask? Do you remember my question about uh, Jesus? What, what was the question? Yeah, may you answer my question then? What is the question? The question is that uh, Jesus, uh, the mother, uh, Jesus, the son of Mary, hmm. how is he a God? And how if you is... answer this question, but how, that... is, how ha has, has he become a God? He's, he and did if not you become a God. Question... Jesus did not become a God. Jesus, God, but has become a, a man. Yeah, for me as a Christian, Jesus does not become a God. Jesus is God who become a man. So he is God by definition. He is God. According to your... Yes, he is God. And let me let me uh, let me uh, help you. Uh, do God knew the future? I want to see evidence, please. Okay, I will show you evidence. Do God knows what you had in your houses? Of course, he does know everything. Do he is God, all knowing. Do God? Do God? Can God read your mind? Of course. Okay. Can God forgive sin? Every everything. Well, Jesus can do all those things your God cannot. Where is that written? Where is that written? All right, here we go. If we, because I don't want to waste your time and my time. I will no, go to, I'm, I'm good. I'm good. Yeah, I will go to the Quran. So you cannot deny it. Okay, in the Quran it says, go, yeah? okay, in Let's the Quran see. says uh, that Jesus, he can create from the mother bird. Do you agree? I want to see you on the screen. I will put it for you on the screen, no problem. Yeah. Chapter 349 and chapter 5110. Chapter 349, verse 49. And, 49? Yeah. And a uh, chapter really? 510. Let us go to 349. Is a, is a shorter. Okay. 
So here the verse confirms the following, that Jesus, he can create from the mud, a bird, and he can breathe into yes. it. Of, of course he can. Uh, let me tell you this. Okay. There are many prophets, right? Okay. Each prophet has his own miracle. God gives, gives him miracles, such as Jesus. Muhammad had many miracles. Can Muhammad uh, breathe into the mud and make it uh, make the, 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 the living bird? But why does he have to do that? His no, name, Jesus' you. name is no, Al-Masih, no, no, Al-Masih Ibn Maryam. Our friend, you speak Arabic, that's wonderful. I'm asking you. Of course I can. If there's any other person, he can create from the, mur from the mud a living creature beside Jesus. Al Allah. Allah. So now, guys, we have two. We have Allah and we have Jesus. Brother, Do you agree on that? Brother, I'm not that dumb. Listen, listen, listen carefully. Allah gives his messengers miracles. And mm -hmm. one of uh, Jesus' miracles happened to be um, okay. uh, giving life to a bird All and right. also healing some you human say, beings. You just say that the one who gives life to the bird is Jesus. Bro, come on, don't play these games. I, I, do you my, think my I'm friend, stupid? Bro? I'm, uh, you're not stupid, you're smart. Did, did, did I use okay, the word stupid? Okay, let me ask you this. Because, okay, you, are smart, you, this. because you are smart, okay. we are, we, no, hold on. Because you are smart, I'm trying to learn from you. I'm asking you, okay. who is I the one you. who gave life to the bird? Is it Allah or Jesus? Allah. You speak Arabic, it says, فَأَنْفُخُ فِيهِ أَنْفُخُ فِيهِ, yes. Okay, who is the one who breathed in the bird? Bro, I... Okay, is... let me ask you this. Don't, 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 don't. please, no, no, you see? No, no. Hold on, see, you're in the okay. corner. Who okay, is the one who breathe? Wrong. Who is the one who breathed into the mud and give it life? Is it Allah or Jesus? According to Allah's words, yes, Jesus. He gave okay. him the, uh, so guys, Isa ibn okay, he step gave him the miracle. Step he gave him step. the miracle. Okay, no problem. But the one who okay, breathed, but the one who breathed, is Jesus, and oh, you agree, correct? He's in Isa, not Jesus. Okay, Isa, no problem, not Jesus. You agree? So, oh, but don't you Muslim, you claim that this is Jesus? Sorry? Don't you Muslim, you claim that this is Jesus? You call him Jesus, but his real name is Isa ibn Maryam. Oh, his real name. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. So listen. Of course. The one, so the one, oh, okay, okay. So the one who breathed is Jesus. You agreed, correct? Yeah, as a okay. miracle. So from inside Jesus, life comes. Oh, my come. God. How would people from follow inside, him if, he from has, inside, if he doesn't have miracles? From inside, that my is friend, that hold on. Let me talk. Let me talk. Bro, that logically makes okay. sense. So from inside the breath of Jesus, from the power of the breath of Jesus, there's life to be created. Do you agree? Yeah. Okay. Can Allah do the same? Of course He can. Prove he it. created everything. Prove it. What do you mean, prove it? Well, now we have we have a clear proof that Jesus can do that. It is your time to tell me how Allah can do what Jesus can do. Allah cannot do. Prove it. Go ahead. وَيَخْلُقُ مَا لَا تَعْلَمُونَ don't, this is a, this is a statement mean nothing. Allah, He create what you do not. What not. do you mean? It's it's, it's on the Quran. No, I want you to prove to me that Allah can create anything. Can you prove to me that Allah can? I'm create telling anything? you now. No. No. It doesn't say translate. People will what? translate. No, no, you cannot translate. Okay, translate. It's written there. It's not translate. People will love. Now I I can't, I can't translate it because I don't what? know how to say it. Oh, you cannot. You speak English very well. No, I don't. No, actually, I cannot translate this this part. You uh -huh. you, you named it. It's a translation of a human being. Okay, let me ask you this. Uh, translate, translate, translate. Okay, please listen, Christian Prince. Uh, Prince. Translate. If you may. Translate. This is funny because you don't want to. Translate. What do you mean? This is funny. So why you don't translate it? It's very simple sentence. Three okay, words. give me one second. I'll I'll try and translate. I'm actually. Uh, English is my second. Uh, I will language, help so, you. By the way, chapter. You quote no. for me chapter sixteen. Verse number eight, yeah. proving Allah to be a false look God. At yeah. Look at this. Allah, he created the horses and the mules. Did Allah created the mules? Is there's a there's a kind that's called the mules? What do you mean? Where is it? This is the verse you are quoting for me. You do not know what you are quoting, right? You, you remember a verse, but no, you don't no, remember. No. So, there's a delay, the verse, I swear. There's a delay. Chapter 16, verse number eight, it says, And Allah is the one who made the horses and mule. If there's no creation. Is it created as a mule? Okay. Mule is a sex between donkey and a horse. I know. Okay. According to the Quran, Allah created the creature by itself. It's called a mule. Okay. 
I I I, to, I I I agree with you because as I've said from before, my knowledge of the the, the Islam is limited. Faisal, hold on. My no 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 knowledge. Is that what? Is that is that how God? So how this God can be? You don't respect others if you do not know. That mule is not uh, created uh, 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 as a mule. There's no kind of animals called the mule by creation. This is this is because oh of the God, you are, donkey and horse. I don't want to insult anything. Listen, okay, let me tell you this. What is the definition of God? The word God. Don't change what the topic. The we, already you answer. I just showed oh you that God, Jesus. Oh. I just showed you that Jesus can breathe into the mud and he make it a living bird. So right now, yes, as we speak, there's birds flying yes. in the sky made by Jesus. Your God, Allah, you think he created the mule? Beautiful. That was a miracle. How is the Let miracle? How oh, this is a miracle? God did not speak? create a mule. Oh my God, he's God talking over me. God did not create a mule. God created a horse, yes. Did my God, can you hear yes. me? Okay, I, I, I understand you and I admire what you said, but can you listen to me? I'm listening. Okay. Moses, alayhi salam. Moses. Do you know him by any chance? No, I do not know him. Have you read about him? No. Are you playing games with me or no? I'm, I'm no, talking, I'm, I'm taking just this seriously. You, when you say Musas, you, you speak about different person. You Muslims, you have a Musas who went to find the fountain of youth. Is that the same Musas okay. you're talking about? Which Musas you're talking about? Uh, th th this is the problem. You know what's the problem? Is that yeah. you, don't, you, don't, you, don't, you don't believe what I'm saying because it's not on the Bible. Okay, let me, let me no, ask no, you this. No, 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 it's not what's because the of the Bible. It's, it's because in the Quran, you have different... Uh, you are the one who said to me, his name is Isa, and not Jesus, correct? So you have different person. You Muslims, you are, Islam is... No, a, is a it's Quran. his name. It's his... Bro, come on, bro. It's his name. No, my friend. The Isa, Isa okay. is the son of Maryam, which is the sister of Aaron, which is the daughter of Amran. Isn't it okay. the Quran says? Isn't it the Quran says? Because your prophet is a false prophet. He said that Mary is the sister of Aaron. Why, why are you? Why are you talking to a guy who who has nothing to do with this? Like, why are you insulting why? Aren't you a, a Muslim? A, a person who... And this is why you are calling me. What kind of God? No, do I'm... not know. What kind of God? He think that Isa, which is Isa, yeah. is the yeah. is the, is is the same Jesus, which is the son of Maryam. This is different Maryam. Maryam, the sister of Aaron, is not Maryam, the sister, the, the mother of Jesus. And your God, he thinks that Maryam, she is the daughter of Amran, but Amran is the father of Aaron and the Maryam, father of Moses. Maryam is Mary. Maryam is Mary. Maryam, Maryam, the name in Arabic is because Maryam. Because you've changed it. No, we don't change it. We, we, we go with Maryam, no problem. We don't say this is the name in English. Maryam. But your, your prophet, because he is a false prophet, he thought that Maryam, the mother of Jesus, is the same Maryam, the sister of Aaron. And this is why we have a chapter in the Quran called the chapter of Ali Amran. It is true that your Quran claimed that Mary father, Maryam, father is Amran. Where? Show me. Are you sure you are a Muslim? Of course I am. Okay, so how you are oh, saying to me, okay. show me, you never heard this before? Yeah, I don't want to tell you what's in Here we go, here uh, we go, chapter 3, verse number 35. And the yo, wife Christian of, Prince, can you let me speak? The wife of Amran, the wife Why of Amran. Why are you talking over me? Can you let me speak? Friend, you, you, you said to me, show me. You're not letting me speak. You just said to me, show me, I'm You're showing you. You're not letting you. me say a chapter word. Chapter 3. You're not letting me. Chapter, okay. th chapter 3. Why are chapter, you talking? Friend, let me speak. You said to me, show <laughs> me. me you said to me, show me. I'm showing you. You're a prophet. I, I didn't do say not know even I'm, I'm, bro, Jesus speak, belong bro, to who? Go ahead. <laughs> let me speak. Yo, yeah. Christian Prince. Hmm. Aren't you supposed to represent Christianity? No, I'm not present, representing anybody. Christianity does not need does not need me to present Christianity. So I believe in Jesus, but you're not Christian. No, Jesus, he is the one who presents Christianity. No one. Oh my God, this guy. Don't say, okay, oh let me God. tell so, you this. Oh my Allah. Don't say, oh my God. You are now... You are not a Muslim no more. Um, God is not your Okay, word. let me ask you this. Okay, it's Don't smart ask answer. me. I, I want you to this. answer. You are the one who said to me, show me where it says that Mary, she is the daughter of Amran. Amran is the father of Moses. Mary is not the daughter of Amran. Bro, I just answered What kind you, of a prophet? You, you do not know who is even Mary. I just Mary. said it. Okay, Christian Prince, let me ask you this. Are you with me? No, I'm not. Come on, I'm not joking around. Let I me ask you this. I be with you because, the Bible, because Muhammad he says... Was what? it the Bible? Was it corrupted by men? Oh, you believe the Bible is corrupted? Yeah, of course. Was well, I'm asking you this question now? 
What I'm saying, my answer is irrelevant to yours. Was the Bible corrupted? Yes or no? That's a wonderful statement, my friend. The Quran says the Bible never be corrupted. Are you accusing Muhammad to be a fraud? How many verses are there in the Bible? Are you accusing Muhammad to be a fraud? Oh my God. Well, how say, many oh verses God, are there in the, oh my Allah. In the Bible? Of course. Of okay. course. Because the original Bible was corrupted. So how the Quran, the verse in the front of you says, confirm what is with them. How it's confirmed what is with us and then it is corrupted. So, so okay, Christian Prince, you're saying that there, there is corruption so, in no, the Quran. No, my friend, answer the question. Yeah, yeah. You just say that you the Bible is corrupted. So how the Quran confirmed the book which is with us? Yeah, no, not this book. There's an original, the original read, Bible no, read came carefully, at the time read of the carefully. prophet. Muhammad, he came yeah, 600 yeah, he came years the after the prophet Muhammad, Jesus. he came 600 years after Jesus. 600 years. They, they, are, they all and have the same message. The, no, it has the same is Islam. This is 600 years of after Islam Jesus. Is peace, listen, not Islam that you mean. Listen, in the time of Muhammad, did the Christian claim that Jesus is God? In the time, of course, they, they, they were okay. Christians, of course. Guys, That's of why course, Muhammad okay, was hold on. to complete so, the message. Okay, hold on. So, uh, the Christian in the time of Muhammad, they believe that Jesus is God. And the Quran saying in the time of the Christian at that time, the Quran confirmed their book. Read it. No, what you're trying to say is that there are people who believe that Jesus is God in the no, time of Muhammad, right? Not, not people they, believe oh, in the Jesus. All the Christian believe in Jesus as God and the Quran exactly. confirmed that. Yeah, I, by people I mean okay. all humanity. So how the Quran, how the Quran confirmed the book with those people? Would they believe that Jesus is God? Yeah, you're saying, I'm, I'm just trying to understand. You're saying that the time of Muhammad, Muhammad, hmm. uh, there were Christians, right? Uh -huh. Of course they were. Okay. That's why Allah sent Muhammad to complete the message. That's why Muhammad well, is the last message. Now. You, say, you, say yeah. the topic, topic, you say that the Bible is corrupted. You say the Bible is corrupted. You say the Bible is corrupted, correct? I said it was, it is corrupted, actually. Okay. The, and so, the how the Quran, so how the Quran saying, I believe, I confirm the book is with them. The original Bible, my brother. But the this is what was Bible. with them. This is, at, this is in the time of Muhammad. So the Christian, they yes, have the original because Bible. They were, it was corrupted. Four, four different Bibles was corrupted. The author is unknown. Unknown. No, we know that. That's why Muhammad it came. Is you, okay, it is you who do not know. Okay, hold on, hold on. You are saying ago, unknown. You see, you, you are trying to run away from the topic. You are trying to run away from the topic. Hold on. Let me ask you. I'm, the Quran today you are reciting. <laughs> where we can find it? Sorry, I couldn't hear you. The Quran today you are reciting. Where we can find that Quran? I, the, what, what do you mean? The Quran, this Quran in front of us. Where we can yeah, find there's the one Quran. Quran. There's no where, other where? version No, of you are lying. You're lying. Your prophet, what he received. You mean you're lying? Your prophet, he received seven Quran. Uh, who told you that? Uh, he told me. Bro, are you, are you, are you just uh, fucking around or talking? Don't serious? use bad language. I will hang up on you. Read it. Your prophet okay. told me. Here we go. I, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm a sinner. Okay, the Quran. I, I did some sin. Allah, he sent. Allah, he sent the Quran. Seven Quran. And Muhammad, he asked for seven because the Muslims, according to him, they are stupid. One Quran, they cannot handle it. So he asked for seven. They can't understand one Quran. So he wanted seven Quran because Muslims are stupid. And the, the proof in front of you, read it. So now you're, now you're being racist towards Muslims. Is that how Christianity is, is, a, is a Muslim a race or religion? Wow. Is a, is a Muslim yeah, a race? Yeah, you're saying Muslims. Okay, Muslims bro, are... you're Arabic. I know you understand me, bro. Don't My be... Friend, I understand. I know you understand okay. me. You are the one who say that Christians are najis. Earthy, kuffar. I, I, where is it? Animals Show me in the proof. Quran, in the Quran. Show me the proof then. We're in Arabic and, and in English for the viewers. You see, you jump like a monkey from a place to place. Even monkeys are Muslims in Islam. Of course, not, you, you, you're, you're a nice racist. Continue on that okay, work. Okay, so, yeah? so are you Jesus. saying now, Jesus. are you saying that monkeys are not Muslims? Monkeys are animals, brother. What, what are you talking about? Okay, here we go. This is the Hadith. About a monkey, she committed adultery, and the Muslim monkeys they stone her. Read it. Where? You will go in front of you. No, no, I want to see it in Arabic. I want to see it in the original. What do you mean? In, I'm, I'm going to show you in Arabic. Okay, you want to you see it in Arabic? Uh, of course. Okay. Let's see. Here we go. Here we go. This is in Arabic. Read it and translate. 
wait, there's a delay. Wait, it's showing me something. That, wait. It's on the front of you. Yeah. No, it's it's showing me the English one. Okay, it's going to come to you now. I want you to read and translate to everybody. By the translate. way, Christy Prince, I I by the way, I uh, respect you. Don't way, get friend. me wrong. It's okay. Read for read for. Save your respect. Let me just see. Where is it? I swear I can't see. I'm just seeing the English. Oh, your screen is too small. It's it's it's, it's shrunk. Oh, it's big now. I can. Yeah, now I can see. Uh, this one had that Yes, read it in Arabic and translate. Go ahead. Wait, are you with me? No, I'm not. Monkey, okay, give me I'm a second. watching the monkey committing adultery. I love you, Joker. I can't believe that this monkey cheating on her husband. He's a Muslim husband. Where did you find this? You don't tell me where did you find it. They read it. No, no. Where did you? Uh, I, I'm looking at the Quran. Where did you find this? You're reading the Quran. I'm showing you a hadith. I caught you. I caught you in 4K. Where did you find this? You cut me in 4K, not, not, not 8K? Yeah. Oh, that's good. No, 4K. I'm pretty sure. I okay. have the Quran in front of me. Where did you find this? What do you mean? Don't you speak Arabic? Read it. I Translate. caught you. Where, where did you find this? In the Hadith. In the Hadith. Can't you I read? said the Quran. No, I said the Quran, not the Hadith. Okay, so uh, why the me, Hadith? Me... So why the Hadith they are saying that the, the, the monkeys are Muslims and they follow Sharia Allah? Can I can uh, can I see who uh, who said this Hadith? Yeah, it's in the front of you. Are you blind? You just read it already. No, no, no. The guy who said it. Bro, the guy Hamad. who said it, bro. This is the one who said that. Because... Can't you read? Right? No, how do you know? How do you, is it? How do you know? Is it Sahih, Bukhari, Muslim? Let no, me know. No, this is Daif Hadith. What do you What you can do now? Daif. You're, this is like any other word, any other text. So I Daif, can't see who, so who said this text. Because, because it's Daif, right? Yeah, it is Daif because okay. there's not. Well, no, it's not Daif. Who, who said it? No, so if it's Sahir Bukhari, you accept it? It is not you who decide. So if it's Brother, it if is it's, not you who decide. So only, so only you accept it if it's from Sahir Bukhari or Sahir Of course, if it's from Muhammad's companions. Okay, here we and go. From, and through generations and through okay, other generations. Go, of course, here we go. This is, it is That's how I believe, Okay, it's Sahir Bukhari. Watch it. Look, it's Sahir Bukhari. You said you accept it if it's Sahir Bukhari. Read it. This is Sahir Bukhari. No, I, I, want, I want to see. Hadith number 3849, Al-Bukhari. There's a delay again. What you can do, monkeys, you know, it's, it's hard to put them in front of the camera. Bro, come on, you know that that's not true. It's Al-Bukhari, read it. You said to me you accept Al-Bukhari a second ago. It's Al-Bukhari. I'm with you, by the way, I'm with you. No, you are not with me because I'm watching the, the monkeys having uh, adultery, fornication. Are you with me watching? Nice. Nice. Uh, yeah, I, I'm just looking. I'm just, I just want to make sure if, if he said that. Because, you know, there's a hadith da'if. Of course, I, I, I think you were Muslim. You were an ex-Muslim. Yeah, 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 yeah. Al-Bukhari is da'if now. Al-Bukhari, it's you who said to me you accept Al-Bukhari. No, accept Al -Bukhari. I'm saying, I, I'm saying, I'm looking for the hadith now. This okay. is the hadith in front of you. It's the hadith in front of you. No, through my yeah, through my own uh, info. I'm just trying to see if it's true, if it's hadith da'if or not. Why? How it's going to be da'if? It's in the Bukhari. Okay, that that is that how you're gonna play? You, you're just gonna talk it over me. It is you who said to I'm, me I'm, I'm if it's like, Bukhari you accept. Not. It's it's you who said that. If it's al Bukhari you accept it. If it's not, you will not. Yeah, but don't you know there's something called hadith da'if? But al Bukhari have da'if too. There's weak hadiths. By the way, guys, there's weak hadith. Okay, hold on. This is in the Quran too. Here we go. What you will do now? You will say to me, weak Quran? Okay, do, do you want me to tell you my answer? Don't tell me your answer now. I want you to read the Quran because now you will say yeah. to me. Now you will no, say no, to me. Hadith. Now you yeah, will say to me, hadith. the Quran is weak. Oh, Here okay. we go. This is the chapter six, the no, chapter of no, animals. No, no. Even the chapter name is the chapter yeah. of an, um, animals. The chapter of animals, Christian, Christian. all the animals Christian, are believers, and Allah are you gonna sent them over Quran. Me? Are you going to talk over me? I'm, I'm not, trying to answer. Uh, you are the one who said this is not a true, no, no, it's no, in no. the Quran too. Yeah, yeah, Christ, uh, Christian Prince, let me, mm. let me answer, okay? Okay. What I'm saying is, I don't know. I, can't, I cannot say anything that I, don't, uh, that I, that I, that I think I know about. Uh, when, I when, know. When, when I don't know this, 
when I don't about uh, when, when I don't know about this hadith, I cannot tell you. Uh, oh yeah, I know. When I don't actually, what about know, the Quran? that's why I'm not gonna talk about it. The Quran okay? says our that's enemies are believers, and they are send books. Oh, you're talking over. You weren't listening. Nice. Mm. Yeah. Mm. There's where is it? There's not a, an animal. Yeah. Yeah. Show me in Arabic. Okay, here we go. In Arabic. Well, can I, can I tell you something? No, don't tell me something. Read first. Yeah, after we read this, I'm going to tell you, I'm going to give you something on your Bible. Uh, so you try to escape from the, from the madness? No, I'm the not ground? trying to escape. I told you, and even in chat, I said, if there's something I don't know, I'm not going to talk about it. Hmm. That's how I'm going to say it. But why are you calling me a racist when I say this is the Quran, the Muhammad, he said, I need No, seven. you said you Muslims. Come on, bro. You know that more than me. You're Arabic. You're, hmm. you know. Are you Arabic or no? No, I am Chinese. Bro, I can tell it from your accent, bro. You're Arabic. You, you no, were talking I'm, I'm, Arabic, I'm, I'm bro. I'm I can black, tell. Blonde, yes, you are American Arabic, bro. You were, even, you were even talking about other countries. Uh, uh, come on, bro. I'm not Your that friend, dumb. I don't even speak Arabic, as you see. You just spoke Arabic, bro. I did not. Prove it. Oh, you're, you're also a liar. So why is Muslims are making videos saying Christian prince don't speak Arabic? Bro, you bro, you just talk to me. What you just talk to me when no, when I, I said not, my name? No, my friend, I do not know Arabic. وما من ذابة في الأرض ولا طائر بطير. I'm not speaking Arabic now. This is Hebrew, Hebrew, Hebrew. So the Muslim they have videos yeah, saying Christian prince do not viewers. know Arabic. Yeah, that's how you play your viewers. So why do Muslims lie then? Why Muslims they say Christian prince do Arabic. not speak that's Arabic? That's how you play your viewers. Okay, Christian prince, can I ask you a question? And, no, don't ask and me. And please question. listen. I want you but, to answer. You are, you are trying to escape. You, I said to you, what, okay, the Quran what, you are reading today, it is the Quran of who, the Quran you are reading today is the Quran of who Allah, he sent seven Quran. You said to me, who okay, are you okay. getting this from? Yeah, yeah, I'm looking, I'm looking. Okay, so Allah, he sent uh, send seven Quran. Why Allah sent seven Quran? Just give me a sec, I'm looking. Okay. Okay. You went in Arabic? Uh, no, no, I'm, I'm, I have my own. Uh... Wait. Where is it? Okay. I have the answer, but I only can say in Arabic. I'm sorry. Oh, uh, why? How come? You don't speak? You forget English now? No, because the answer is in Arabic, and I'm really bad Arabic. at translating. You know, I'm sorry. I do not know Arabic, so you have to say it in English because I don't understand Arabic. Yes, you know Arabic, but you, 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 you trust me. That's not what you Bro, that's English. What you, All what the audience, doing I have 1,400 people what saying, doing? nobody speaks Arabic. Why you want to answer in Arabic? If, that, uh, if you call me speaking in English, you know that the channel is in English. And now we have 1,400 people. Your ears maybe, are closed. maybe the only one who speak Arabic here is you and me. So why you want to answer in Arabic? Yeah, no, because you can translate. You're better than me at English. No, you speak you with English. Go with ahead. Your... Don't worry. You don't worry about your English. Go ahead. Translate. Tell us what you want. Okay. What do you, think? you want my answer? Yeah. I do not know about this one. Hey, this is an answer. I do not know. Okay. Now, yes. So now, can each I, time I show you I something, say you say I do not know about this. So you, you Muslim, you lie to us. You say we have Quran, yeah, yeah. And the okay. Quran is can, preserved. Okay, can I then say, we ask you, what is the seven Quran? You, you say, I do not know. Okay, yes, where is the whole Quran? Okay, hold on. Yes, the Holy Bible. Which one? One, okay, two, three, four. On. I don't know which the, one. Yeah. Okay, the, the, Holy okay. Bible, the Holy Bible is confirming the Quran. The original. Okay, we don't want to go to that. Let no, me tell you this. this is the one we have. This is the only one we yeah. have. Yeah, let me tell you this. So, you know so, the story about so, King where, James? So, oh, listen, Abdul. When oh a Muslim, my God! Now, when, now when, I listen. When a Muslim, it's my turn. When a Muslim, it's, it's a conversation. Turn, it's it's my turn. turn. I should talk it's as your well. Turn since the beginning. You are the one who called yeah. me. You are the one who started the I topic. Said, I said, I told you the, one the answer. The one who chose the topic, and now you are saying to me, "It's my turn." No, it's not your turn. You are changed. You know, you are trying to escape. No, uh, but okay. Now, 
You said to me you do not know about this. Now you know, so yes. you have no excuse. That, okay, so there's seven that's Quran. That's my answer. There's seven no, Quran. No, I said I know it in Arabic, but where, I cannot explain, explain it in seven, English. I'm sorry, I don't seven know. Where is the seven Quran? Uh, brother, where is the I answered Quran? you. I said no, I do not know. No. Allah alam wa ana la alam. What do you mean Allah alam? So your prophet did lie? What do you mean with Prophet did so not, You're not so, making any sense. So did you lie to me? Did you lie to me when you said the Quran is preserved? Oh my God! Well, I, I, th I think I think you were actually bullied when you were a kid. I actually think that you were actually bullied mm. by, what, what, by what, Muslims. What, what bully? I think what, so. What bully mean? What bully mean? Explain to me what bully. No, you now you know what bully means. No, I don't you know. No, I'm learning from you. Means. Tell me what bully means. Now you know what bully means. Now you, you know what bully me. means. Yeah. Let's let's be real. Let's be real. You know what bully uh, means. Let uh, me ask you this. Okay, you know, hold, hold on, hold on, hold on. I heard that there's a kid. He was bullied. His name is Muhammad when he uh, was a now kid. Now you're getting out of con okay. and his own out kill, of and his own kill, his own kill wife. He make fun of him always, and even they kick him out of the house. Is that correct? Who, who's, who, who's that? What is that? Your prophet. Show me. Give me, how do you know each time stories? I show you, how each time I show you. How do you know this? Yeah, I want to know. I want. I want to know. I want to know. I want to know knowledge. I want. I want that knowledge. I want to know. Uh -huh. How are you? How are you say, claiming when you don't have proof? Okay, uh, let us let us go. And to by the, the way, okay. if it is written, okay, it's called the tilat. Okay, okay, okay. Here we go. Okay, I'm answering you. Your it's prophet. called the tilat. Okay, listen. It's here called the tilat. Every messenger, every messenger has to struggle. How your prophet struggle? For example, Muhammad, he watched his kids die. He watched his wife. He watched his friends. That's how it is. That's he what he he couldn't um, ask for forgiveness um, uh, for his parents no, because friend, they were not Muslim. You're a prophet. You say iftila. Your prophet, he said that he was uh, uh, he he uh, the iftila he have by lies. He have a lot of lies. How how can he tell it's a lie? Let me let me ask you this. The prophet says so. What's wrong with you? Are, you? are you against your prophet, Faisal? Are you insulting no, your not. prophet? Okay. I told me. you if something read, I don't know read, about, read, I'm not read. gonna answer okay, because friend. I don't know. Okay, my friend. Did your prophet have a problem? The problem was lies. What do you mean by lies? Lies, lies, you know, lies. Tell me. There, of course, Muhammad never said the lie. Why would you say the lie? He he, he was full of lies. He wasn't, actually. Why not? He was clean. What do you mean, why not? Why not? Is, is that because he's a clean? Bro, it's so sad that you don't want to know the truth. Actually, It's really, really sad. Well, Muhammad, he was full of lies. No, it's really sad that you don't want to know the truth. No, I'm, I'm I am the say. one it's who's really showing sad. you the truth, and you are the one who do not no. know the truth. Do you know why? Because you're talking over me, and you're not giving me a chance. Mm. That's why it's really sad. Yeah. Well, my friend, it's very okay, sad. It's, it's very sad. It's very Christian. sad. I'm asking you. Christian. Did your prophet? Yes. Did, did, did your prophet full of lies? Was full of lies or not? What? Did your prophet? He was full of lies, yes or not? I just answered like a hundred times, no. Okay. So why the why the hadith says that there's women they used to take lies from the head of Muhammad? Oh my god. That's why I can't answer you, bro. Why you can't answer? Because you me? you're giving me weak hadith and more so I know, don't know the answer. How do you know they are weak hadith? How do you know they are weak hadith and because it didn't come it didn't come through his companions. So the hadith came from whom? There are there are some uh, at the time of the Prophet, there are some companions who didn't listen to Muhammad but believed that he said this and that. Okay. But what we believe in that Muhammad uh, when he when something happens uh, and Muhammad explains his companions uh, write it down and tell it to, to others through generations and generations to come and then that's how it works that's how we, you find a strong hadith actually. okay okay so but this is this is confirmed hadith that the prophet used to be full of lies what we would do according now. to your website yeah yeah according to the okay, website what do, you mean, what do you what do you mean according to the website are you must have making fake website um, bro, you know, you're not making any sense. Oh my. Okay, my let friend, me ask you this. My friend, uh, I'm not the one who's making that sense or not. This is your Muslims. Okay, us Muslims. Yeah, us Muslims. Let me ask you this. May I ask you this question? Uh, King James. So you're a prophet. You know King James. Was he full of lies or not? Why are you running? Why are you running from this Order question? One. Let me ask. Why are... <laughs> okay, King James. Read you know me. King James. The Read version. me. 
Read with me. King James. King James is a translation. It's the Bible. Okay, read with me. Okay, so, let me ask it you say, this. Does it say that there's a woman, oh, her name is Ummu Haram? Ummu Haram. Did you, Muhammad, he used can you to see say, the viewers? Can you see that, guys? He doesn't want to listen. You are changing he topic. You are listen. trying to run away. Your prophet is full of lies. No, what, is full no, of lies? No, I'm not changing topics. Why you're your prophet is full of That's lies? That's how it works. Okay, I want to know. I want to say mine. You're adding you more to topics. You said every prophet, Allah, he sent him a problem. What was the problem of your prophet? Allah sent him lies. Read it. Okay, nice. Can I ask you this question now? Why are you King James. What, why aren't you answering? Because I really don't know. I don't want to say anything. So your prophet that is full of lies. So your prophet full of lies, correct? Okay, according to you. Okay. No, not now, according to me. Either you, you uh, either you agree. Uh, well, at least I will we not, respect I will other not religions. go forward unless you agree. Okay, that let me ask you. Your prophet is full of lies and the proof in front of you. A woman, her name is okay. Umu Haram. A woman, her Why name is Umu Haram. Can she I ask used you this? to feed him. She used to feed him. Is the wife of Abu Ubaidah, Abu Ubaida, and she is the one who used to clean his head from lice. Okay, beautiful. Can I ask you now? My question? Beautiful. Do you agree or now, not, bro? You talk. You were talking for like. Do you agree or not? Can I ask my simple question that you, you Christian Prince, can answer? Do you agree that you're, you're the only one who has the answer? Yes. And I want to know. Okay, okay. I want to join Christianity. I want to know this answer. Can you answer this for me? Yeah. Okay. I will give you an, uh, this answer. So you don't want to okay, answer. Okay. Now. Okay. Now. Yeah. Okay. Do you know King James version? I do not know. He doesn't know. How do you know then? I don't know. You tell me. I don't know anything. I'm learning from you. Everything. Uh, how, how are you Christian when you don't know about your version? I don't know. I don't know. You tell me. What is? Do you know what King James Version mean? The name. I really. I, I've never read the Bible. As I've said. Oh, this is a but translation. This, proof, this right? is a translation. King James Version. It's no, a translation. It's not like you Muslim, you say translation for the Quran. You say Ali. Jesus was. So don't tell me okay, King okay, James listen. Version. Okay, now go. What do you want to say? Do you know this guy, Jihoi, Jihoi Khen? I don't know his name actually, so I don't want to disrespect his name. Uh -huh. Do you know, you spell his name by J E A H O I A C H I N? What is that? Say the name for me. That's the name. Oh, you don't know. Oh, my. He doesn't know, and he's a Christian prince. Oh, my no. God. Tell me the name. What J E A H O I A C H I N? Okay. Wait, wait, wait. That's what is written in, in your okay, read the name. beautiful read the holy name Bible. Me. Read the name for me. Yeah, that's his name. His name, I cannot spell his name. Okay, let me read my, his name. Jehoishin. Jehoishin. That's how I read I, Yeah, that's how I read his name, actually. This, are you, are you this out, name. Are you out of a fuel? Yes, no, brother, his name is Jehoishin, bro. Jehoishin, okay. Yes. Okay, let me, let me type in chat. Okay, what, what the chapter are you reading from? Can you tell us in the, uh, you know? I'm watching your live. You no, know, what you chapter, what verse you are reading from? Oh, uh, uh, this is uh, uh, 36 and 9. What? what? Uh, 36 and 9. As, I, as I've what said, chapter, Arabic what, uh, is my first language. Okay. Listen, Faisal. Obviously, you're trying to scale. Okay, let me. No, no, no. You're Christian, trying to scale Christian, the stupidity of you your version. You know that Arabic is my first language, and I want Who to tell you this. Who cares about your Arabic first language or not? You know, okay. Yeah, that's why I cannot. As, speak. As long Arabic, I just learned English as long last Arabic year, is your first language. Arabic is my first language too. Do your prophet speak Arabic? Why did you lie then? Why did you, you say I don't speak Arabic? That's me. That means that you're a liar. I was doing. How can we believe you when you lie? I, I was joking with you. Muslim because Muslim what do you mean I was joking? Muslims they have tons of videos saying and Christianity there's jokes? Arabic. Do you guys yeah, joke around? Jokes. Yeah, there's a joke. I will tell you a joke. When I was asleep, there's two angels they come to me, they cut my chest, okay. and they put a dish of wisdom in my chest. What? Okay, nice, nice. That's how what you enter nice, nice. uh, the okay. paradise. No, I want, to to to, I want you to agree okay. that I am wise. I want you to agree that beautiful. I am wise and I am smarter than what you. What a beautiful soul. Because, because I have a dish of wisdom and dish of faith in my chest and you don't. This is his name, uh, by the way. Let me type his name. Okay, Faisal, listen. It's, uh, I'm here for many hours. Okay. This is his name, by the it's way. Already in chat. for hours. Okay, fin uh, finish fast. Yeah. What you want? What's his name? What? Where the name? You find his name. You find his name. What's his name? That, I, I typed his name down. Come on, I'm losing my patience with you. You can't even quote the chapter. Say chapter, etc., verse, etc. Bro, I, 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 I just go, man. Call me tomorrow.
What a kid. You can't even quote a chapter name, chapter, book, etc., verse, etc., and that's it. You can't say the name, no problem. Crazy people. Anyway, guys, I cannot stay longer because I have a lot of lies. I am a very clean person. I like to take a shower with dead dogs and women in blood from period. And the reason I take that shower with dead dogs and women in blood from period and garbage because it is against Corona. This is the way to fight Corona. Dead dogs, women blood from period and garbage. You put them in the bathtub. You mix them together. Be sure that the water becomes stinky. And then you jump. After you jump, you have to be sure that you are covered totally by the holy water, which is containing dead dogs, stinking things, and women in blood from period. Now here, you will notice that women, they are very useful. Even their period can be a medicine. The prophet, he don't do things unless Allah told him. So when he jump in the stinking things, as the translation says, he didn't see any stinking because he was more stinky than the stinky. For him, it was so clean. The smell is so good because he stink more. This is the only way we can explain it. Because how in the world, a person, he jump in a stinky, but he don't see the stinky. He see it as a clean. And as you see, he says, it is a, it's a pure. And nothing make it impure. They said to him, Oh, Messenger of Allah, are you performing wudu on the well which the body of dogs and menstrual rags and garbage are thrown in it? He said, <laughs> Idiots. Pink Panther. Water is always pure and nothing make it impure. In case you are wondering how big this water is, it was in the size of a jacuzzi. And it's not a well, it is a dry well where water from sewage come to it. This is Muhammad, which is Faisal trying to defend. Now he is worried about King James Version, which is translation, but yet he cannot even quote the name. And when he want, he speak Arabic. When he want, he don't want to speak in Arabic. And when he want, he can speak English. When he want, he don't want to speak in English. This is exactly what Allah made out of them. And when you say stupid, he say, are you saying you're racist? Muslim, they call us pigs, monkeys, animals, worst of the creatures dirty, filthy, whatever. And then the second you say stupid, oh, you mean racist? They play victims. They love to play victims. Nobody insult as much as Muslims do. All Islam is insult. Insult to the Hindus, to the atheists, to the Christians, to the Jews. The second you put them in their place, they play victims. It doesn't work with me. Anyway, Faisal is welcome to call me again, maybe tomorrow if we go live on air. Guys, I have to go. It's already four hours. Did we have a good time? If you think we have a good job for today, as usual, don't forget to make a comment because comment can bring more people and can force YouTube to suggest our channel for others to watch. Don't forget to give a like. Don't forget to do a simple thing. I give from my life long hours. My knee is, is hurting from sitting and bending my knee for the last four hours take you only a comment say something about something you heard if you cannot do that you need to ask yourself what is the purpose of you to exist or why you are even here all of this we are doing for the glory of the lord so more and more will leave islam anyone will listen to this he will die laughing at this cult and now i have to go excuse me because i saw a monkey for nukating against the knowledge of her husband her husband he did not know the poor guy he is Mr. Chapanzi. He is decent. He is praying to Allah. And she don't know that this will hurt him badly. She knew for sure. She is an evil female monkey. May Allah curse her. She committed fornication. Because other male monkey, he have a bigger banana. And you know, size does matter. And I'm talking about banana now as a fruit. Don't take me wrong. So Islam is very convincing. Islam is true from God. The only religion 
who can come with a lot of stories. Fountain of youth, the guy who is ice is a blast. He sit in the ground, he make the uh, the, gr the ground green. Monkey who committed adultery, may Allah curse her. This is why I say to you, if you are single, never marry a monk. I'm telling you, marry a deer, maybe it's okay. A cow, monkeys, they cheat. I'm telling you, I'm not being racist now against the monkeys, but it's proven by the Prophet of Allah and his companion that monkey females, they are not decent. They do fornication. And me, myself, I will never date a monkey between two brackets again. Thank you very much for being here. May the Lord bless you. And this is your brother, Christian Prince, who was serving you for today. I hope you did enjoy and you learned how silly Islam is. And Islam is not what they say. It is what Islam says, not what the Muslim says. Thank you. God bless you. See you soon after we have more than 20,000 view of the video. So make it happen as soon as possible. So we will be back. God bless. I mean, again, he, he doesn't know who Gabriel is, right? Because he didn't come from an Abrahamic faith. The people of Mecca were pagan. Quran has mentioned if this book was from other than God, they would have found in it many contradictions. If a book is without contradictions, that has no bearing on whether it comes from God or not. I've had phone books that are inerrant, but I certainly don't think God gave them. <laughs> that we believe without understanding. The brother asked a very important question that most of the scholars say that listening to music, watching movies, and most of the television programs, they're haram. So how can we have fun? Let me tell you, brother, at the outset, that having fun is permitted in Islam as long as the fun is halal fun. <laughs> that the standard narrative has holes. The prophet tells us because Satan or the devil sleeps over our nostrils. Those who oversleep and not pray Fajr on time, Satan urinates in their ears. I really do think Jesus was crucified and that he really was dead and buried. He, he thought that he was a son of God in the sense that he was specially chosen by God. I think Jesus really did think he was going to be the Messiah, the future king of Israel. I mean, that is after all why they crucified him. 